Good evening, everyone. How's everyone doing tonight? Tonight we are back with Borderlands 2. And we're going to jump into the DLC stuff. So, I'll pull up the website here in just a second so y'all can see. But, if I can remember correctly... It says, do any of these three pretty much in whatever order you want. And then do the headhunter stuff. Uh, I don't remember where it said to do Dragon's Keep. Or Raid on Destruction Keep. I do remember that it said to save Fight for Sanctuary last because it leads into Borderlands 3. Oh, so I'm going to pull it up real quick so you guys can see it. So I can see it as well because it's on the same monitor as the game. Okay. All right. So, sorry, took me a second. I had to put my mic on this page. I don't usually have it on here. It's just not the other one. Oh well. Y'all just won't get to see me for a minute. But yeah, it says to do the Captain Scarlet and Mister Tortuga stuff first. So not. The So Scarlet is Pirate's Booty, which I think we'll go do that one first. And then P Campaign of Carnage is Mr. Tortuga. And after we do those, it says to go do Hammerlock. So hunting. I'm looking at, just in case y'all want to know. I'm on Mental Mars. So after we do Hammerlock, I can see it. My scrolling sucks. It says to do Salt on Dragon Keep. That one. And then do the headhunter stuff. Okay. okay. So it doesn't matter what order we do the headhunter stuff in. Do it last. Oh. Well, you know what? I don't know rate what rate on destruction peak is or where we should play it.
It just doesn't work for me. Whatever. We'll figure it out. So. Alright, I just wanted to let you guys know what the game plan is. And I'm kind of thinking at the moment, I might change my mind before we get there, that we will do Fight for Sanctuary after we do the pre-sequel. But I'm not 100% on that yet. We might do it and just let it hang. I don't know. So, but let's go do, let's go to the Oasis. Let's get started. There was a big pile of treasure in the desert, and the Volt Hunters found it and killed all the bad guys. The egg. No, 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 that's not how you start a story. I thought it was pretty good. And I think you're not getting fed this week. No, this is how you start a story. Legends speak of Captain Blade's lost treasure of the sands, of a prize so great that men would turn their sands red in pursuit of it, of a pirate queen, courageous and deadly, who would stop at nothing to find it, of a monstrous leviathan, of the Vault Hunters who journeyed to the desert town of Oasis, not knowing the horrors that would befall them. See? That's how you do it. Mine was more succinct. Your life's gonna be succinct, you dirty little orphan. Welcome to my lovely town of Oasis, stranger. Now, if, if you could please save me from the filthy sand pirates trying to steal my water! <laughs> Alright. Got sand pirates to deal with. Oh. Okay. I was not expecting to not be able to use the vehicle. But the chests are even different. It was fine. Uh. Psychos. He's got some firepower over here. What you got? Rap Scallion? Guys, I feel like there's going to be a lot of uh, dialogue or scared story told through here. So I'm going to run the music a little bit lower than usual. 
so it's still there. But so it's not interrupting. Or at least that's the plan. Hopefully. We have treasure chest and not treasure chest. Kill no I guess we'll probably have plenty of time to explore the city. Maybe, I don't know. Guess we don't have to be too aggressive about looting. We've already beat the main story. You know, beard. This is our turn. Thank you so very much, my friend. Yes, 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 yes. Now that my water is safe, let us chat in person, like people. Like people. What's that ruckus coming from Oasis? Oh, is that a fool hunter I see? I'm Captain Scarlet, and something tells me you're here for the treasure, same as I am. So, we've got two options. We can work together and split the treasure, or we could just try to kill one another. Or maybe both! Come find me in Wormwater, yeah? Well, I was gonna go over there and look myself. I am Shade, and you, you are the coolest person I have ever seen. Please don't go. Please. You've cleared Oasis of Pirates and met the eccentric Shade. Now it's time to roll up your sleeves, metaphorically. Get dirty, Are we doing a staring contest? I will win. I am super good at staring. And properly begin your quest to find the buttload of loot. Don't leave. Non metaphorical. I'm lonely. The townspeople of Oasis, thank you. If you're looking for the treasure of the sands, you want to talk to Captain Scarlet. She's set up in Wormwater. You'll need a sand skiff to reach her. Use mine. It's the least I can do for the stranger who saved the many living people of my town. Oh, you're so cool. Many jobs for you. Nothing says party like booze and corpses. Have you met my friend Frank? He is a very gruff man and an alcoholic. Yes, it is a tragedy. He becomes very irate if he has not given the finest whiskey. Could you please procure some from the merchant caravans nearby? Sure. Guns, guns, guns. I've always got new stock. Check yeah, back the later. um level requirement on this, if I remember correctly, was like 15. So we're uh, way over leveled. That's what we get for saving the DLC for last. Still, we get XP off of it. And it can get us to a better spot to beat the, uh... Well, it was a Thrasher Mall, but I don't know... I don't remember what it was called. The Big Bad. The one we checked out at the end of the last episode, or last play session. What the heck is this? 
Are they real bodies or mannequins? Okay. That one looks like it's human, a real human. That one I wasn't sure. What do you call it? A sand skiff? Oh no! Did my sand skiff just randomly explode, forcing you to stay in Oasis and hang out with me some more? Darn! Well, my other friends out in the flats might have some sand skiff parts for you. They are very nice and alive. Go talk to them. But be careful. If you step on the flat sands out there, the sand grubs will hear you and eat you, and then you won't be able to hang out with me. Sounds like... <laughs> Doing a little bit? Alright. Looks like there's another quest over here. So grab it before we run out to the desert. There's doctors. Not anything special. Rock you rest stop. That you rap scallion. Message in a bottle. Bottle with a note in it. This will either lead to some treasure, or you're in the middle of a really bad romance novel. You have found one of Captain Blade's bottles. Inside the bottle, you will find a key. The key opens a chest. The chest has loot. The loot will help you kill things. Find the chest, my friend. Did we just get another golden key? This one looks like it's closer than the other two were. Yeah, it looks like it might be right here in town. Ooh, it is a stalker, but it's a different breed. Or different species? Species. Those two shells, but I gave them to you. Yeah. 
These are called Tritail Talkers. Heck, some extra spot. You uncovered the hidden treasure. Hey. Proving that messages and a bottle hold a purpose beyond sappy melodrama. Blades Vogue. Had to stage another fake execution today. One of the cooks was caught stealing from the treasure hole, so I had to pretend to kill him to keep the rest of the crew in line. Gave him enough cash to disappear, shot him overboard with a blank. <sighs> Keeping up this face some Captain Blade retains a hell of a lot of work. <laughs> Makes an orphan makes orphans often. Four by four by four point four times weapon zoom. Curse of nefarious backlash. Eight hundred and fifty percent weapon damage. Consumes two ammo per shot. Fire is faster than pull the trigger. And funny. Oh. Okay. I didn't realize they were in town. At least some of them are. Maybe. Oh, no. They're all the... several weeks ago as a gift. Take it! Could I please be getting surprised with that shake? You are so attractive. Okay. I didn't realize that was the, uh, the speaker when we looked at it earlier. I see it now, though. Oh, uh, this dude is loony. Hi there, dude. I'm Jennifer. Clothes and boys in high school and gossip. <laughs> That's Jennifer. A nice girl, but very naive. I think she has a magnetic overthruster you could use for the sand skiff. Uh, thank you. A few more sand skiff parts, and you'll be on your way to Captain Scarlet and the Lost Treasure. You didn't expect me to but jump up on her, did you? Alone. <laughs> well, hey, how you doing? They call me Jocko the Joker. I'm a laugh a minute. Hey, what's the difference between a skag and a lack of water? There isn't one because they'll both kill you. <laughs> oh, 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 he is a cut up. Oh, gosh, Jocko. Jocko borrowed one of my pressure regulators for one of his comedy bits the other day. Find it, and it is yours. I could have stuck this steak somewhere else. Oh. I didn't even get the dispenser, pull it dispenser from her over here. I didn't realize that. My doctor's regulator. I found it. Did he take his skip apart? So that when somebody came, he could take them <clears throat> scavenger hunting for the parts?
Go around and meet all of his loony friends first. All right, now we gotta talk to Lionel. That's when we take the bridge. Because otherwise we'll be eaten. I mean, at some point, y'all know we have to step on the sand. To find out just how bad it is. Like, is it an instant death thing? Or is it something we could kill a few times and get some XP? with something on it? Speaker, maybe? Why, hello, person. I'm feeling very good today and not that from thirst. How are you? Ah, uh, you've met Lionel. How are you, Lionel? Not dead of thirst. Ha 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 ha. Oh, tell me about it. How is your family? Well, they... That is a great story, Lionel. Friend, I believe he has an engine capacitor stashed somewhere nearby. It's yours! No, the worm got it. The worm is that we're supposed to avoid, right? Oh. Locate sandworm. Queen. That's a big egg. That's a big boat. Dropping that anchor. All right, where you at, Queen? Welcome to the slot. You have everything you need to rebuild the sand skiff. Just think the lovely people of Oasis. It's good we have so much water. Otherwise, we might have died of dehydration. <laughs> <laughs> Please attach those parts you retrieved to the sand skiff. Then you may scan oh. it and summon one from any catch a ride machine. I missed the boat up there. I don't think I'm gonna rock the shotgun this entire time, but I am like the shotgun. Oh. All right, <laughs> get back to the skiff. I love the chase and the hunt, and I set the pace when I'm running. I always take what I want, and I always. 
always giving 100. Don't need a bank, no, I'm buddy. Yeah. Play the game like it's nothing. I'm always thankful for something. Don't take for good and stay humble. Now wake up. It's time to look at the enemy. Cool in this first <laughs> Magnetic over thruster steering wheel. Pressure regulator. Roster. No. Oh, she is fixed. Wonderful. Please hit that button to digit scanner into the catch a ride system. If you want. There, you may now destruct a sand skiff from any catch or ride machine. Before you go off to meet Captain Scarlet, though, you must return to me. What's that I want? Mini rocket. If I want it, right? Alright. Wait. Yeah, I already have that one. Okay. That one wouldn't be bad either. Well, it may not have been bad when we were fighting harder enemies. I wonder if we can come across another um, class mod or artifact. I had no reason to call you back. I just enjoyed your presence. For XP. With shades, hovercraft repaired. You can finally head out to Wormwater and find Captain Scarlet. Ooh, ready to... Are we doing a staring contest? I will win. I am super good at staring. You're cheating. You have glasses on. Are they made of wood? I enjoy spending this quality time with you. Captain Scarlet has been tracking the treasure of the sands for several years. You should sail out to meet her in your sand skiff. Ooh, my sand skiff. Oasis needs your help, my friend. Collect pirate gear for Jocko. Help a brother out. You have met Jocko, yes? He is a simple man with very big dreams. He, he wishes to be a sand pirate, you see. I'm sure he would love it if you could give him some piratey prosthetics. Uh, teeth, peg legs, things of this sort. Another one of those? Okay. <clears throat> Bearing the past. This mo mission has explosions. Can you help Aubrey Callahan with her stalker problem? My great grandma used to be a sand pirate around these parts, but I don't want anybody to know that. Her old ship is just outside of Oasis. I need you to scuttle it and erase any evidence of the creepy stuff my grand -gram used to do. Go get the explosives I stashed for you. Wow. She's a bit of a bitch. Guys, I know we can get the skiff, but I'm going to walk for a second. Wait, let's see how far out this is. It's not that far out, but we're going to walk for it. We get worms. We'll kill them. if you can fly or that was just a good jump. Can 
they fly or was that just a good jump? y'all hear me talking about xp and stuff and i already told, said that we don't really need xp for this mint for this dlc but our ultimate goal is to be able to face <coughs> big bad dude big bad thrasher thing right now so we need to get what xp we can get I'm not saying I'm gonna go out of my way to kill things. Okay, who am I kidding? I will go out of my way to kill things, but I won't go out of my way to kill things. Y'all understand what I'm saying. Ugh. We've got what, 13 levels to go to reach 50. Oh. Thanks for agreeing to destroy Graham Graham's old ship. I don't want to tell you the kind of stuff she was guilty of, but let's just say it rhymes with child schmafficking with some schmanibalism on the side. <sighs> Find out anyway. Is that it? Oh, it's further out that way. That's another town or whatever. I don't think I did any damage to that one. Oh, I did. I'm noticing there's some variants. Like that one was wider. I guess I need to pay attention to the names and see if there's a little bit of different. I think there, there might have been. This one is just a sandworm, and it's one of the wider variants. Neither shoot rockets, harpoons, or saw blades. Let's go with harpoons. candy cane magic marker okay don't know why that's the name of that one easy and clean
honestly, I think I'm gonna rock the evil candy cane. Hate them, guys. All right. Boy, it. Go do it. Wait, what? Oh, it hovers. I forgot. It's a hovercraft. Oh, this might take a little minute to get used to. Explosive too? Are the harpoons explosive too? I think they are. Oh, and we have a minigun. I just, I think I may have just. <clears throat> hit the circle and switch seat. Well, I figured there'd be stuff around here to tell us. About her great grandma, the great gram gram. <laughs> but I'm not seeing anything. I mean, that's what she's worried about is. this stuff that doesn't really take any looking for it Some guns. <laughs> Plant some explosives. Let's just blow it up. 
Still not full on SMG ammo. Oh, I guess we didn't blow up the ship. Go do the one that was over here. Hey, Vault Hunter guy, need your help. My grandma used to be friends with Captain Blade, the guy who buried the treasure. He left his pet stalker to my grandma when he died, and she took care of it and stuff. But then she died and left it to me, and I'm like, I don't want to take care of a friggin' stalker. They're gross. So go kill it for me. It's an oasis somewhere. What? I mean, I don't mind killing stalkers, but <clears throat> girl seems to think we're her errand boy or something. their limbs. Looking at me! 
We had a ring behind us. Kill people up there and not collect <laughs> stuff. Thank you, Joe. 
Maybe I should have let him finish his whatever he was saying. Chopping block. Fire water was nuts. That one. Wingman even further out. Roughly the same thing. So, fire water. Where are we at again? Is this the rush yard? If this is the rush yard, then there's a quest around here to pick up. No, this is canyon. Something. Green smoke coming out of an exhaust pipe. Probably not a good thing. So was there something else? I don't want those to be the kind of missions where we have to go find the recording, not Mark, or like the uh, Goliath one, where we had to build the Goliath, pick up the mission, and then we, we miss it. I don't, I don't want to miss it. this and I thought it was a J and I was like that doesn't make any sense out here in Oasis just running through the desert nothing but my shoddy Okay, we could go up there and just get another skill. This is not a sandworm. Uh, 
another berry. I thought there were it was following another berry. We're only getting one XP a kill. Oh man. Oh crap. Thought we were done. I was trying to reposition. Almost did it again. is not going to go up very quick like that at all. Oh well. We're already halfway, almost halfway through the third round. There. Word. Find some whiskey. One tail pato. Hold on a second. I'll double check worm water, not worm tail. Best with rats. Walking into my bullet. I didn't see any rats though. Mm. 
These are oddly placed. Let's go get us some whiskey. Do y'all think we walk out of Pirate Oasis? past Iridium. One was already at half half health. I don't know about the second one. I didn't look. Coral Island. Turn the drinks to him. Our inventory is full, so I guess we run back anyway. Wasn't the plan, but. I hate not being able to pick stuff up. Our 
backpack size again. I'm not sure. I'll, um... After the play session, I'll, uh, run back to this area. I'm going to Frank. Frank, where are you? <laughs> oh. Hello, Frank. I am a tough man who says tough things in a growly voice. I can take corruption. You have a problem, Frank. You are so drunk you are speaking the gibberish. Please return to me, friend. My poor Frank is beyond help. I should do a, what is the word? Intervention. You're later, the scooter. Please don't leave. I'm lonely. Re return to shade. It's probably for the best that Frank is already dead. That booze you just collected would have killed Are him we anyway. doing a staring contest? I will win. <laughs> I am super good at staring. Collect pirate gear for Jocko. Some might say that you Please don't leave. Completing the quest for shade. Shade, you're enabling his delusion delusionable delusional behavior Are and accelerating his contest? downward spiral. I will win. I am Those super people good at staring. Are stupid. Oh, these pirate things are so wonderful. Jocko will love them almost as much as he loves telling those hilarious jokes and not being dead of thirst. Sad thing is he knows. Like he's not delusional. They're not he knows they're dead. He's just lying to himself. With her great grandmother erased from history, Aubrey can now attempt to live a normal life. Free of child scam mad skim skim. I goddamn hate my great grandma. Seriously. Alright. Oh look, good. That one takes us to warm water. And best friend. Oh, inventory first. Lock and go! I mean, I will look, but I'm not going to look, look. Probably gonna want the rocket launcher at some point, but we probably still need to make some SMG kill. Oh, I think about it. Problem. Still need to. Okay, this has ends. This is not the right way. Probably still need to make some rocket launcher kills. No, 
X's as fuck. I didn't want to just far. or help. Iridium when you get it. Iridium. Why is it we can collect money? I just and ammo by just walking over it. At least when it we're looting it. But iridium we can't. Kinda understand items. Indestructible sign. I understand why we can't pick up guns and other items. But money and iridium should just get vacuumed up. That end. Okay. At least the fire of the skiff doesn't burn us. point yeah. probably paying us with her grandmother's blood money anyway yeah.
think I found the bust here. An engagement ring? You have found the ring? Oh, happy days! Please! I feel too shy to propose myself. Could you do me the favor of asking Natalie to marry me? Absolutely not. I can't believe this! Are you shooting me? Eat this, man! That could have been bad. Thought that was the uh, undiscovered quest, but no, that was maybe it was. But I thought I remember seeing something called Wing Man. Opto. Quest log Wing Man. Nice haul. Where are we at again? Don't remember, but it ain't one of these. Oh well. Oh, gotta go down first. Gotta explore the whole place. Oh, <clears throat> Wingman is an undis is not an undiscovered. <laughs> just the one that I said they look like they're just right on top of each other, just about the same spot. <laughs> down here to get some worms. I don't think we're at full ammo. Actually, yes we are. Not one of the other ones we've already met. 
Okay, so there's a chance. It might be a living a living woman. Man, I had my hopes up. Just slip the ring onto her finger and see what she says. Oh, shade, marriage. This is moving so fast. And you know, I don't believe in marriage. I'm sorry, shade. The answer is no. She said no? Oh, woe is me. I gave you my heart, Natalie. Return to me, friend. At least you have not betrayed me yet. <laughs> I didn't expect a no. <laughs> I mean, I get it. He's crazy. <laughs> no? Doctors are always cute, fuzzy, when they grow up. Here, money. Woo! up, bitch. Natalie turns Shade down. Thankfully, ensuring that the two will never share a honeymoon. I enjoy spending this quality time with you. Everything turned in. This is the main, uh, other one for the main storyline. So, all right, we're gonna jump into Study and in Scarlet in the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you next time. Have a wonderful night.